What's up, y'all? Your boy, yeah, noob, some coolest that I have been geek. Welcome to my channel, Tomorrow War with Chris Pratt. Your boy out here, I don't know, killing aliens, zombies. I'm getting from the title that they trying to live until tomorrow. <laughs> it's a war for tomorrow. And from the character posters, they seem like they were armied up. Like, niggas came through with the straps. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So... Let me just move my logo one time. Let's dive right into tomorrow. War Amazon Prime. Okay, none of you are my child. Has anyone seen Muri? Didn't they, they just buy M MGM, like James Bond and the likes, for eight billion or so? Yo, soccer game. And a bunch of people from the future showed up. We are fighting a war 30 years in the future. Is this a joke? Goddamn. Our enemy is not human. We need you to fight. You got drafted. So they came back from the future to get them prepared in the past? What about the teacher's deferment and the veteran's deferment? If I don't go, they're going to draft you in my place. But if something does happen to me, you and Mary will be taken care of. Goddamn. If something happens to you, Dan? 70% of draftees do not return. Sometimes a man does what's best for his family, not himself. So are they getting people from the past to the future to fight with them? Oh, a seatbelt. Was it a driving test? No? You don't have jokes in the future? What's this test? This device facilitates your jump to and from the future war. One minute to jump. Oh, here, buddy. Take that. Like I damn, oh, they're just oh, drafting oh, anybody. Yeah. Kind of a short story, I guess. Three, two, one. Yo. Seven months time, all human beings in the future will be wiped from the face of the earth. Unless you help us. What an interesting premise, though. July 2nd. I was trying to save my daughter. I Yo, the world a safe. twist on the whole time jump situation. Normally you try to change the path, but taking people from the past to the future. Here from the face of the earth. We are literally living on borrowed time. There's still a chance that we Yo, this never happened. The money they put in this Amazon. God damn. Well, it's nice knowing you. <laughs> Teach it has some comedic moments. Yo, those the aliens? Tomorrow war. Ooh, it's gonna have jump scares and everything. God damn. Yo, Trying to get to the title card so I can speak about it. It's PG 13? Wow. So they were really trying to like corner the market if it went out in the theaters. Because I was like thinking first, it's like giving Amazon props for making it. Then I was like, no, Amazon bought the rights to it while I was thinking. But I let the trailer play and you're always going to talk about it after. I remember they made this movie, then Amazon bought the rights to it, right? It explains the PG-13 rating. You know what I'm saying? For all audience, come see an action film. You know what I'm saying? They're giving you 30-day free trial. Why are you still here? Why aren't you... Okay, great. If you start the 30-day free trial now, you won't... <laughs> it will be over. <laughs> By the time July gets here. So, started in... Middle of June. You're welcome. Smart brain play. You might watch Invincible, The Boys. Uh, what is it called? Uh, the show with Orlando Bloom and Cara Delevingne and their fairies and stuff. It was the second season of that show anyway. I'm asking you, Amazon. <laughs> it looks dope. The premise is interesting. I mean, we got, like I said, a switch of genres. Normally time travel films they try to go back to the past to change the future but now they they basically recruiting people from the past for the future 
which is very interesting. And it seems like there's going to be some giggle moments there and there with that scene where they go into the future and he talks about his life being a long story, but it's a short one. The humor, you know, Chris Pat delivers on that, so I'm not surprised. I'm mad excited, though. Like if you like more, actually subscribe. If you're not subscribed, deuces.